We're here to capture all of the East Coast, capture its essence, so we can create the most authentic miniature version of what we see. It's been a long trip. We started in PEI. We're getting a real feel of what the cities and towns are like, and we're trying to just really capture the feeling of the East Coast. Welcome to Little Canada. Little Canada is a new tourist attraction that we're creating. We're making all of Canada in miniature form. So it's everything you would see in the big Canada just shrunk down to 87th scale. Um, so everything is teeny tiny. There's little cars driving around and, you know, whole mountains fit inside a single room. Oh, there's like a, a rooftop. The challenge is definitely getting everything to fit in. <laughs> as much as like we're doing miniatures and everything's tiny, it's still limited space. And so we really have to like pick and choose what we put in and what goes where and how things relate to each other. And being able to do an accurate representation and like an authentic representation while still having to work within these really tight constraints of space. This is good for animations. Well, I build a lot of the tiny little structures and I'm so excited to do all the small, colorful, cute little things. It's so beautiful. I'm overwhelmed by how amazing the scenery is. My part at Little Canada is storytelling and high details, but the scenery is just incredible. Wow. I think it's just really interesting seeing the scale of everything because when you're looking at photos and stuff you don't really like see the whole picture of like what everything is and how it all relates to each other. I didn't think it was going to be as mountainy as it is. There's hills everywhere in St. John's which I did not realize. Everything is a hill. <laughs> After this, we're driving up to Deer Lake and we're going to Grossmoren. So I'm very excited to do the boat tour through Grossmoren. Uh, and then we're heading home after a long trip. 